This section I'm going to show you how to find your pictures, set them up in Windows 10. So in Windows 7, basically you had a library that said pictures and everything you saved there would be in the pictures library. You could also click on start and go to pictures. It would take you to the same place. In Windows 8, you have the photos application and on the desktop, similar to Windows 7, you had a pictures library. In Windows 10, we saw earlier on my start menu, I have the photos live tile right there. I can click on photos. And it went through earlier on my hard drive and found photos that I had as well. Now, modern applications of Windows 10 run windowed or I can run them full screen. Now when I open up photos for the first time, it's arranged them by date. That's actually in sort of folders, not really, but it's set up that way as filters. So I can see when these pictures are taken. Now I definitely put a series of related photos in my pictures because they're all from Italy and it hasn't created the albums from it. So this may be a feature that is not working yet. Obviously this is still pre-release software, build 10.162. July 15th and Windows 10 does not release till July 29th so this is something we can revisit in a, in a, uh, a video after the release of the product. Anyway there are albums I can select a picture I can clear it um, I can click this icon to share I can copy it I can delete it clicking on the ellipses just gives me a little bit more um, labels on those so I don't have to guess what those mean. Um, right now I have it tied to my Microsoft account. We talked about how um, it gives you uh, access to more services. Part of that you can see in the settings um, it would show photos automatically fr from videos on my OneDrive. So if I had anything there it would be pulling them in automatically. If I have pictures in other places than just the default location of the photo library, um, I could click add a folder. So say if I had moved a lot of my pictures off to an external hard drive, I could add that folder right here. Click on add a folder and tell it where in this PC to get those from. Right now I don't have anywhere else to get those. It automatically enhances the photos. And as you can see, these enhancements are not saved in the file. They just appear on pictures that can be improved. It sort of makes a copy under the covers. It linked duplicates. So if the exact same file and it looks by seeing the date, the other metadata that's underneath. So if I added that second folder here and I had a copy of a picture that was the exact same thing, it would just show it as one image here, even though it may actually be in more than one place. And then on the live tile, which is what we're talking about here on the start menu, I can tell it what to show on the photos tile. So just a single photo or recent photos are the options. So if I chose a single photo, I would choose the photo that I want it to be, but I would rather have it flip through recent photos and then that way this live tile will change as you just saw there. I can sync to pick up more photos, use that to select photos. If I attached like a USB camera or a thumb drive or anything, I could click on here to import files as well. And that's really how you use the Photos application in Windows 10.